Wednesday morning and our last official full day here. We leave tomorrow at like 10 or something, like in the morning. So we're probably not gonna be able to really do anything. We're just gonna probably pack up and go. So that means today is our last full day to go and explore and do things. It's very cloudy out. What else is new? A little upset about it, but it's okay. We're still gonna make the most of it. And then when we go back to New York, guess what? The weather is beautiful there. So that'll be good at least. I don't know how the weather flip-flopped once we got here, but it's fine. I'm just currently tying back my hair because I'm gonna film a little get ready with me for a whole separate video here on this channel. I'm in this really cute white fox little like one piece. I'll show it to you guys. I'm just like so cold <laughs> in the room that I am just wearing sweats over it. But our plans for today are to go to the Hollywood sign in a little bit and like kind of hike there, kind of drive halfway. I don't know, we're gonna try to find a loophole to not hike the entire way up, but I'm really excited because I've always wanted to see the Hollywood sign. So we're supposed to be going and doing that like really soon. I don't know, I have to text Brooke and see what time we're gonna go. After that, I think we might go to like Rodeo Drive, drive around the hills and just like literally explore and do a bunch of stuff today. So that's the plan. Um, but last night was really fun. We went to an all vegan Mexican restaurant like you guys saw and it was really good. And then after that, we went back to the Grove, which is literally my new favorite place. Like I'm not even kidding. I always have watched people go to the Grove on YouTube and I've always wanted to go there and it really, really did live up to the hype. Like I wish we had somewhere like that in New York where you can just like walk around. And like everything just looks so cute with the little twinkly lights. It's just such a vibe and I love it. So yeah, we did that last night. We honestly had so much fun together just like being silly little girls. And then we came home and I fell right asleep. So now we're on a new day for new experiences. It's gonna be so fun and jam packed with activities. So I need to get ready and then I'll check back in with you guys when we're on our way to our activities. Okay guys, finished the makeup. I'm all ready. I have these sweatpants on because it's cold out. Um, we're not gonna leave to go to the Hollywood sign until like 12-ish because that's when the sun comes out, but me and Sam don't wanna just like sit in the room since this is our last day. So we're gonna walk around a bit. There's a Starbucks like eight minutes away. So I'm thinking maybe we can walk there because I have not had Starbucks in over a week, which is insane. And I feel like every coffee I get here is just doesn't hit the same. The coffee in the hotel at the one hotel really was amazing, but it's just like since then at least I haven't had good coffee. So I really want to go get a Starbucks. So we're just going to take a little walk along the beach and be outside. So let's go. We're not going to see the Hollywood sign. Um, I'm really upset about it, but it's okay. We're gonna go to Rodeo Drive um, because I've been really wanting to go there. I know they have a lot of like really bougie stores and I don't know if you guys watched my last vlog, but I really wanna get myself a nice wallet because I literally don't own a wallet and I wanna just like treat myself a little bit, get myself a little gift for this big accomplishment of making it to California for the first time and you know, being flown out by my dream brand, Miss White Fox, you know. I just want to treat myself for all the hard work I've put in over the past few years, so. Hopefully I find one that I like, because I'm not just going to get any random one. I really want to fall in love with it. So me and Sam are going to have a little date day, date day and go to Rodeo Drive and then like explore. I don't know where else we're going to go, but we'll just see what we can find. Maybe we can try to see the Hollywood sign. I don't even know like where it is. Like I know where it is, but like I don't know how to get there. Um, so we'll see. I don't know. We have to Uber. So like I don't think the Uber can take us to the Hollywood sign. I don't know. We'll see. But we're still gonna have a good last day here in California. Okay, guys. 
guys we made it to rodeo drive i love it here it's so cute everything's like bright white and just really aesthetic i looked in dior where else did we look in fendi i looked in dior fendi ysl oh was there another one uh maybe i don't know i don't know but i i obviously didn't want to film inside these stores because it's so like bougie and like there's like barely anyone in each store so i just went in there looked around see if i liked anything the only place that I actually liked one was at YSL but I really want to look at Chanel first because like Chanel is like my dream brand to own something from so we have an appointment because I had literally had to make an appointment like how bougie is that <laughs> to go just like look inside the store so our appointment's in 10 minutes we're gonna go there check out the ones in Chanel and if I don't like any of those then maybe I'll just get the YSL one because I did really like it but I don't know. I'm looking for like a small little wallet. <gasps> I'm out of breath. You shall see. It's really nice here though. Guys, I did it. Look. <gasps> I can't believe it. It literally doesn't feel real, but I did it. I went in there. I found a wallet that I loved. I literally found one that I found she online like months ago and I fell in love with it so when they had it there and she was like it's our last one I was just I just needed to get it and I really love it and it's so my first big girl purchase so now I can always remember this trip because I got this wallet and I'm really excited I'll do like an unboxing when we get back to the hotel I just don't want to take it out of its packaging right now but now we're going to in and out because I really wanted to try it before we left and I just think it's funny like we're going from Chanel right to in and out because that's just how we that's just do. how you roll that's just like you know what i mean so yeah we're ubering to in and out now i'm really excited to try it hopefully it's good i i feel like there's like a lot of mixed reviews on in and out some people hate it some people love it i don't even eat burgers so i'm gonna get like their vegetarian burger that's probably just lettuce on a bun but i'm just really excited to try their animal style, style fries so and I'm gonna give In-N-Out a second chance. Yeah. The last time I had it, I was definitely not impressed, but I'll get it again today. Fuck it, we'll see what happens. Yeah, wish us luck. I'm so excited about my purchase. All right, a driver should be a rolly thing. This is amazing. I'm loving my life right now. Yeah. Guys, we are in love with In N Out. That was so freaking good. I like, have a story. Amazing. I am like in shock. Yeah. <clears throat> Cause I really didn't think I was gonna like it that much. Like I really went in with like low expectations because I heard people complain about it and like say that it's not actually that good. And I was one of those and Especially people. from him, because he tried it before. Last said it time I like came it. here, the food was tampered with. Yeah, it wasn't good. He went to a different location. And it turns out today, that location that we were going to go to is the one I went yeah. to, and it had horrible reviews. So we, we made the executive decision to Uber out to the Sunset Boulevard location. That's where we are right now. And it's actually fire. It, like, so good. It turned my world upside down. Like, I was like, wow. Like it was literally like nine, like two different, completely different places because yeah. this was so amazing. Whereas that place was like horrible. I got the grilled cheese with like everything that a burger comes with, just without the meat because I don't eat like red meat like that. And Sam got the burger, and then we got the animal style fries, and it was and to die shake. for. Oh, and the vanilla shake, and the vanilla shake was like one of the best amazing. vanilla shakes I've ever had. Fucking amazing. <sighs> No, that was the best. That was the, by far the cheapest. It was twenty dollars for all that, which is sick, and by far the best meal we've had here. Yeah, so true. And now I'm excited to come back here and have that again. So, success. Okay, we are back at the hotel, and I'm gonna do a little unboxing of my new Chanel. Look how cute the box is. I love this little flower sticker that they put on there. So freaking cute. I'm literally saving all of this packaging because it's so nice. But yeah, and here's the bag. I'm really excited to open her up and actually like put all my stuff in it. Um, so like I said, I've been needing a wallet for a very long time. 
And so I really just wanted to splurge and get something that I've been wanting for so long. Like this exact wallet I've been looking at online for so long and it just so happens that they had one left in their store. And she was like, she looked online and there was like none in any of the other stores too. So it just made sense. I just did it. So here we go. Are you guys ready? Are my hands clean, yeah? Here she is. Look how beautiful she is. I'm obsessed with it. I love it. She is gorgeous. Like, oh my God, are you kidding? I love it so much. Love everything about it. I love this exact design, um, the purse version of it. So when I saw the wallet, I was like, oh my God, I need to get it. Literally so stunning i'm obsessed with it now i'm gonna put all my stuff in there it's just gonna be amazing today we really did every last thing that i wanted to do while we were here in california we went to in and out went to rodeo drive i got this wallet i've been literally saying i am gonna get a wallet when i go to california so i literally checked that off the list and now for the rest of the day i think we're gonna go get dinner with um brooke and paul and them since it's our last night then come back here pack up and we're gonna go home and i think i'm ready to go home on Honestly, like I feel ready. I feel like I did everything I wanted to do and it's time to go home Okay The Sun really just didn't want to come out today. It's actually really upsetting So I think I'm gonna wear this hoodie and the jeans to dinner tonight because I've been way too cold here It's like unfair <laughs> but Brooke and Paul and all of them are in Santa Monica already so we're gonna go meet them and I think we're gonna take the electric scooters because Last time I was really scared to use them when we had to go like in between the cars and everything But on the beach right here, there's like a little path on the beach That takes you literally straight down the beach So we could just get on the scooters and go all the way to Santa Monica from that little path We don't have to be like interfering with traffic or anything Which makes me feel a lot better because the scooter actually was really fun So I think me and Sam are gonna scooter our way there right now Meet them in Santa Monica they, I think we're gonna go to like a vintage shop or something and then we're gonna go to dinner. So, I'm thinking, contemplating if I should bring my camera or not. Yeah. Do you think I should just vlog on my phone? Yeah. Okay, I think I'm gonna vlog on my phone because having the scooter and like having my big old camera on me is really too much for me to handle. So, we're just gonna vlog on the phone for yeah. the rest of this vlog. Um, I'll see you guys later tonight when I get back. Because we're going to need to pack up everything when we get home. So I'll see you guys then. Love Later. you. I'm falling to pieces in my room. Are you coming over? That's cool. I could use a little something to do We could go outside, take a little ride if you want to That's cool I did what I supposed to There's nothing left for me to do So now I'm poking out my head through open windows You guys don't get it, we were looking for this song All the way since last night, you guys just wanted to say Okay guys, we're in bed. We have just packed up everything. Everything's all over there. We just have to zipper everything up, but we're gonna do that in the morning. We have to wake up at like 6 a.m. for a flight back to New York. I have my biz line in, <laughs> so I sound funny, but we had an amazing trip. I hope you guys have been liking the LA vlogs. We, I need to go on more trips. This is what this trip told me, so. Comment down below where I should go. <laughs> I love you guys so much, and I'll see you back in New York. Peace out.